Charles and Shannon, Eric Thames is on pace to hit more than 80 home runs this season. A remarkable feat, making him a new fan favorite for those who fill these seats. However, his success has come with some backlash from players wondering how he's doing it. At Miller Park, you'll hear plenty of cheers. Go Brewers! And cracks of the bat, especially from number seven. Yeah, Thames! First baseman Eric Thames has been hammering the ball. Best one on the team right now. Quickly becoming a Brew Crew favorite. Come on, baby, Thames train! His jerseys are all sold out at the park store. Yeah! Andrew Besiege says Thames' success is worthy of a makeshift version. I threw that in the printer and grabbed a Brewer font. This is Thames' first season back in the majors after spending three years playing in South Korea. Something has certainly clicked since. Thames has 11 home runs in April. He brings a whole team up there on top. Just three shy of tying the major league record for the month. Every single game that I've been watching, a yeah, home run every single game. His success, however, has come with questions of steroid use. All these other players are just mad that none of their players can get on his level. Thames has been tested by the league three times this spring. Negative, negative, negative. He says might as well keep them coming. I'll be here every day. I have, I have lots of blood and urine, so. <laughs> <laughs> Thames exited the game a little early today with a tight hand string he's expected to be back in play on Friday reporting at Miller Park Ben Jordan today's TMJ4